This is a princess only thing, Wally. Yeah, you get off. Your boy. Bye bye, Wally. Wait, no, come on, dude. Come on, let me get on your raft. That's not fair. I'm gonna drown out here. You won't drown. You'll be fine. Yeah, your raft's right behind you. Wait a second. What? Oh my gosh. Come on, wait. This one's way smaller than yours. This is not fair. But ours is big because we have more people, of course. Oh, come on. Wait a second. Why am I the only one here? I thought I was a powerful king. Where are my people? You don't need any people. You can have one on that tiny little raft. Bro, come on. Please, just give me another person so that we can make this fair. A 1v3 is not cool. Um, no, I'm not going to the vo boy side. Are you guys going? You no. I don't want to. Yeah, that's what I thought, Wally. Can't you just, like, give me a boy? I mean, yeah, we can give him one. I guess. Fine. As long as they don't give us cooties. Exactly. Ew, cooties. Hey, yo, wait, what? No, no one will be kissing you. Come on, give me a night. Fine, we'll grant you one night. Wait, really? Let's go. Wait a second. Where's my knight? Where's my knight? Whoa. Oh, wait. Uh, Casey, are you serious? Are you really my knight? Of course I'm your knight, dude. I'm just gonna be such a good knight, man. All right, whatever. Let's go ahead and beat these stupid princesses. You guys are going down. And wait a second. It looks like you guys have your own island and I have mine own island. Yeah, and ours is so bright and colorful. So much better than yours. Oh, yeah? Well, me and Casey's island are gonna be way better than yours. Come on, Casey. Let's go over there. Grab a boat and let's get over to the island. Oh, yeah. I can't wait to build our ultimate kingdom. All right, Casey, what are we gonna do on our awesome island? I have a feeling we should make an awesome castle to prove that our kingdom is gonna be way better than the girls' one. I think that's a great idea, Wally, because I think we have so much space for an awesome castle, but I think we need to start by cutting down some trees. Oh, yeah, true, but this is gonna take literally forever! And I thought you would say that, so I kind of brought something along with me on this trip, and here it is. It's literally an awesome creative wand. Wait a second, a creative wand? Are you telling me if I go ahead and right-click this it'll put me in creative mode absolutely yes it will all right well i'm gonna right click it in three two one and boom now i'm able to fly and look i have access to every single block in minecraft this is gonna be so sick casey not only that but you also get powers of magic oh well, wait a second magic is super cool because we can clear these trees out way quicker with magic oh yeah Absolutely. All right, well, I'm gonna get into the new breaking down some of these trees because we don't need them. And uh, I guess if you wanna use magic to clear the rest of them, you can, but I have a feeling I'm gonna be pretty fast. And hey, yo, all the trees disappeared. Did you do that, bro? Yeah, all I did was some super cool magic and got rid of all the trees. All right, well, first things first. Well, I, well, since the trees are now gone, we should probably go ahead and level this place out. So let's go ahead and get rid of this extra dirt that we don't need. And where do you wanna put the castle in the middle of the island? Yeah, I think we should put the main castle building in the middle and then we should have some awesome walls going going around the area. Oh my gosh, that sounds so cool. Oh, well, I'm gonna go ahead and get a little bit of a magic wand and go all the way over here and go all the way over here and just right click right here and do slash slash set dirt and boom. Look, now we have a place to build our awesome castle. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. But I think this looks a little bit more flat. Oh my gosh, why are you the magic wizard? Okay, listen, what should we do first again? You said we should make an outline. So I think some stone bricks would make a pretty cool looking castle. What do you think? Yeah, I think stone bricks would be a really cool design. And um, these are kind of weird looking and they're literally infested, man. What blocks are you using? Hey, yo, what is it? I got the wrong block. Wait a second, what does infested mean, Casey? It literally means silverfish will spawn. I'll literally show you. Oh, wait a second, what's a silverfish? Oh, uh, hey, yo! What the heck? That block just turned into dust. All right, well, let me clear my inventory and get the correct thing. So we need stone bricks. Where are they at? Uh, oh, there they are. All right, sorry about that. All right, let's continue building this wall up. Let's go ahead and make this thing super tall. Um, we should probably have really tall walls for our kingdom so that they can't get the advantage on us. Yeah, that's a good idea. And I think I'm gonna make it out of all stone bricks. And if we ever want to change a little bit of the front design later, we can always do that. I know, because magic's so cool and it allows us to have infinite possibilities when it comes to building our awesome base. So boom, just like that, we have a couple more stone bricks and I think if I go over here and make another one, it'll go ahead and make this pretty quick and boom, look, dude, I'm constructing these walls super fast and I'm also making them two layers deep in. Hey, yo, what was that, Casey? I built an awesome tower so we could build and, and have a really cool center area. Maybe even put an enchanting table in it. Oh yeah, that's gonna be super cool 
an asshole, I think that you should go ahead and put one right here as well so we can make an awesome entrance. Wait, look at this, Casey. It's gonna look so sick. Good idea. All right, well, while you do that, I'm gonna go ahead and change the floor of our base to something a little bit better than dirt. And what are you thinking? How about some quartz? I think quartz is gonna be an awesome design because it's super clean. I know. Look at this thing, man. This is so sick. And actually, once we get this entrance complete, we should probably go over to the girls and see what they're doing. And actually, I'm kind of curious what their base looks like so far. And they've only placed a little bit of stairs on their plot. They're so slow. Oh my goodness. Our base is gonna be so much cooler. We already have like the whole design done. Oh man, this thing is actually looking so sick. And let me go ahead and fill up this gap a little bit. And while I'm doing this, I think I'm gonna start thinking about a little bit of defenses for our base. Oh yeah, we definitely need defenses because we don't want any crazy princesses getting into our base. Exactly, Casey. So the first thing I'm gonna do is make a little bit of a lava moat. And how does that sound? Oh my gosh, dude, a lava moat sounds so awesome. It does, and I think it'll make our base a million times better. So let's go ahead and put that right there. Do slash slash set air. Boom, look at that, Casey. Now we have a place to put all of our lava. Oh my gosh, dude, that lava is literally gonna be so protective for us. I know, right? And watch this. I'm gonna fill it up with this magic super quickly. If I do slash slash set lava, boom, look at that. Now we have a lava moat. Bro, they literally cannot get over that. I know, right? And I think I'm gonna build a little bit of a bridge real quick just so that we have a place that we can walk and also maybe they can walk, but little do they know that the inner blocks are gonna be made of ghost blocks so they'll fall into the lava. Oh my gosh, they're gonna have no clue that this is such a good troll. I know, right? Here we go. Let's grab these ghost blocks real quick. Let me make sure that this is correct. And boom. Now when they go to walk in, they'll just fall into lava and die. <laughs> they're gonna have no clue it's there. It's gonna look so cool. And let's just make it look like a casual bridge too by adding some walls. And the only way we'll be able to get across it is if we just walk along the edge. Oh my gosh, that's so smart, Wally. All right, well, since that's finished, what should we do for the actual entrance? Should we make some giant gates? I think we should make a giant gate. It'll look so cool. All right, well, while you do that, I think I'm gonna get started on our first room. Good idea. And for our first room, I think I'm gonna go ahead and make a little bit of a war room so that we have a map of the princess's base as well as a place that we can strategize our troops. So let me go over here and go all the way over here and do slash slash walls. And boom, just like that, I have a little bit of a room made, Casey. That was so sick, am I right? Yeah, absolutely, man. But um, I think you should probably hurry up because honestly, this front is almost already done. What? What do you mean it's already done? You literally have one piece of wood made. Yeah, but it's a super cool gate on like uh, whatever you've been building. Whatever, fine, dude. You do you. I'm gonna go ahead and make our war room look sick. So let me go ahead and break an entrance for the door and let's go ahead and grab an awesome garage door because garage doors are sick and they look amazing. Boom, now that that's finished, what should I make the roof of this place out of? I think the roof would look really cool if it was made out of maybe some like glass. Oh, that would be pretty cool. Let's do that. Set glass and yo, this looks kind of cool, but it's not very secure, but you know what? Who cares? It's gonna be our awesome war room. So let me go ahead and grab some wood and go ahead and make a bit of a platform to put some maps on as well as we're gonna need a bunch of chairs. So let me grab this awesome office chair that you can literally sit in and roll around in because these things are awesome. Oh my gosh. And I think I just finished the front entrance and I think it looks super cool. Wait a second. Let me go ahead and see this thing in a yo. Wait, this does look pretty cool. But how are we going to get in? And wait a second. Is this ghost blocks? Yeah. So they think that they can't get in, but it could be super easy to just slip on in and we can attack them from the other side because they won't see it coming. Oh, wait a second. You know what would be a really good thing to put before this? A bit of a fall trap into the void. Oh my gosh. That's so smart. All right. So let me go ahead and clear a bit of this. And then I need to go all the way down the bedrock once I finish this and make it go down to the void. So I'll be right back in a second, Casey. All right. Don't take too long, though. All right. Here we go. I'm almost there. And oh, yo, there was a cave down here. And boom. Now I'm in the void. So let me go ahead and TP to you, Casey. Boom. Just like that. And now all I need to do is do slash slash one. Grab this and then go all the way back down here and right click it on the bedrock. So let me go ahead. Right click this. And now if I do slash slash cut, we should have a massive void for them to fall into. Oh my gosh. But look at all this water that's coming down. We're going to have to clean this up. Hey, yo, wait a sec. I think there's a command we can use like slash slash drain. And boom. Now it's all gone. Look, Casey, I just fixed it. Oh my gosh. This looks so cool. And look, the fall straight into the void. I know this is going to be such a super deadly trap. And you already put some ghost blocks right here. But now what else should we put in the base? I think that we should go ahead and put a little bit of a fruit stand right here. 
here. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. I mean, the people who literally are living here are going to need some way to get some food. Exactly, Casey. So I think I'm just going to make an outline of this because I just realized we should probably go over there and troll the girls. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, well, what should we troll them with this time? I'm thinking we could probably do something pretty funny. All right, Casey, I think I came up with the perfect plan. You know how girls always like diamonds? Yeah, they literally always want them from me for Valentine's Day. It's kind of weird. Hey, yo, okay, well, I've never had a Valentine before, but I do have some diamond ore mines. So if you come over here, Casey, and go into survival mode, you should be able to walk into it and it'll explode. No way. It won't actually explode, will it? Oh my goodness. Is it that sick? So I think we should go over to the girl's place and pretend we're going to give them some diamonds as an awesome gift and then they're just going to explode. That's such a good idea. Let's go do that. All right. Well, let's go over here and hello, ladies. How are you doing today? Wally, what are you doing here? Don't you have to go build your own castle? Well, we were just coming to see how your castle's looking. Come on. Do you guys hate us that much? Yeah, pretty much. You're not even supposed to be here. Well, listen, don't worry about that. We came here to give you a gift. Here are some complimentary diamonds from our kingdom. Oh my god. Diamonds? Ah! Wait, what is this? Hey, what's going on? Nothing. Uh, one of the diamonds just exploded. What just happened? Wait, our build. Hey. Oh, man. Uh-oh. I did not think that was going to happen, Casey. Uh, let's just get out of here. Get out here, Wally. Oh, man, that was sick. One of them accidentally blew it up, and I, I noticed that only, like, one of them blew up, but I guess that's fine, right? Yeah, no, it's fine. I mean, honestly, I think we did enough damage as it is. It's gonna take a while for them to clean it up, but I guess we have to clean up our side, too. Exactly. I mean, we didn't do that much damage. At least we put ours away from the base, and then we put it right in front of theirs. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea, and I think that we should have eventually put a little bit more detail onto the front, because their front looks so much better than ours. It does, actually. I think you should work on that while I build our next Room. Let me go in here and finish our war room. So the thing we need is some paintings in here to make it look just a little bit better. So let's put a painting right there, one right there, and one right there, as well as we should probably get some leaves in here just to give it, you know, a little bit of greenery, you know, because we want to be healthy and stuff, but not like a vegan. We don't like vegans. What's wrong with vegans? I don't know. I think Brooks won. All right, one more leaf pillar and boom, this place is looking sick. But the thing I wanted to do is get some item frames right here and put some awesome maps on the table. So let's go ahead and put the item frames right here and grab a bunch of maps. Let's go ahead and grab 64 maps. Put one right here. And this is going to be the center of our map. And look at this. It looks so sick. But I just realized it's not fully filled out yet. So let's go ahead and fill it up a little bit. Oh, wait, what direction do I need to go? This way. And boom, just like that, we have one map. And then I need to go all the way over to the girls' base without them seeing and grab another thing of their map. So let's go over here, right click the map. And this should be able to give us a clear spot to see what they're up to. And look at this. This is their entire map. So now we're able to put this on our war room and strategize for attacks. So let's go in here and Ayo, hey, okay, see this thing is looking sick. I know I put so much work into it and I think it's going to come out really well. I think so too, Casey. All right, well, hold up. Let's do this and then let's go ahead and do this and boom. Now we have a complete map of the girl's base and our base and wow, uh, this map doesn't really look good. Casey, can you fix this one eventually? Yeah, I'll fix the map in a minute. All right, well, while you do that, I'm going to grab some barrels to put on the floor right here just so we can go ahead and store some stuff and what should the next room I make be, Casey? I think we should build an armory if we haven't built one already. Oh, right. We haven't built one of those yet. All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and work on that. Let's go ahead and grab these two corners and do slash slash walls. Let's go over here and make a doorway. And let me go ahead and grab another one of those garage doors because the garage doors are my favorite door in Minecraft. What's your favorite door, Casey? I really like the acacia door because it gives so much airway in it. Hey, yo, acacia's disgusting, bro. What do you mean? Wait, what's your favorite wood type? Uh, My favorite wood type is probably either birch or acacia. I love those colors so much. Uh, uh, my favorite is personally just oak because I'm a little bit basic. So maybe you should rework your brain. Well, that's kind of mean to say, Wally, but you know, maybe it is a little weird to like orange and like a really light colored wood. Maybe I like jungle instead. You know what? That's a way better one. Uh, everyone watching this video, comment down below your favorite. And actually, since you said jungle, I just put down a jungle table inside of our war room. Oh my gosh. Let's go, dude. All right. Well, inside of the war room, Casey, I'm going to put a bunch of armor stands to put the armor of our troops on the walls just like this. And then also they need to know who they're fighting for. So let's get a painting of our kingdom. So let's go ahead and put one right there and one right there. And oh no, that was the wrong spot. And then uh, maybe we should put another one right there. Yeah, that looks pretty good. So what type of armor should we give them? Diamond netherite? What do you think? I think we should give them either some silver armor because it looks really knightly or we should give them some netherite armor. All right, how about both? I think that's a great idea. And now let me grab some of that silver armor. Boom. And this stuff actually looks pretty sick because it actually makes them look like knights of our kingdom. Oh my gosh, I know. 
boom that looks pretty good and now we just need a place for the weapons so let's go ahead and grab some chests put them at the entrance so you know they can go ahead and grab some swords and stuff on the way out and we should probably just fill this up with i don't know what type of sword a lightning sword that seems pretty cool what our knights are gonna have lightning swords that's so awesome of course because the princesses never probably have ever seen a lightning sword and they do so much damage really how much damage do they do nine and a half hit points it's pretty sick and look at this place no way dude oh my gosh there's so many batman logos in here uh that's the thing of our kingdom not batman who the heck is batman i don't know what i just said anyways i just finished the map and it looks so cool hey yo wait hold up i'm gonna come over and see once i put down this carpet because you know i just realized that um these floors are kind of cold so we need something warm for our feet and boom now it's complete oh wait i forgot a spot boom let's close that up and i want to see this map does it look pretty sick and yo it looks way better i know i put so much work into it i think it looks really cool because we can literally see everything even our tiny raft dude this is so sick anyways i think we should build a treasury next because we have so much gold we need to hide dude that would be so sick because you know our nation is super rich and strong and we're full of gold so let's go ahead and make a little bit of a vault uh you should construct it because you know how to make them strong right oh of course i think we should put it a little bit under the ground in case some cannons hit our base and we're not able to protect it it'll be super secure because it'll be partially underground you know what that's a pretty smart idea but you should go ahead and make the walls of that and i need to go ahead and finish this fruit stand that i was gonna make earlier wait you still haven't made that bro i'm so hungry no oh my gosh all right fine i'll make the fruit stand and then you can go ahead and eat because you're so fat bro i'm not fat uh have you looked at yourself in the mirror recently bro i think you're pretty fat okay it was only a couple cheeseburgers it couldn't be that fat well, you know cheeseburgers are the leading cause of heart attacks in america did you know that no way i thought it was pizza no pizza is actually pretty healthy because there's tomatoes on it and i think a tomato is technically a fruit i just finished the roof of our fruit stamp boom this thing looks sick so let's go ahead and grab some tables to put in this place how about some birch tables even though they look pretty disgusting i think it'll look good in this place what i still think birch is pretty cool uh whatever you say so let's go ahead and grab a fruit bowl let's go ahead and put like a couple of those down boom boom and we can put some right here let's go ahead and grab some watermelon because melons are super sick go ahead and put one right there and right there and then we'll put a bunch on this back wall and then what other fruits should we put back here um have you put apples yet in there apples hey yo wait a second there might be some apples in here let me find one and nope i got a tomato does that work oh and some corn yo i love corn all right well i'll have to grab an item frame for that and just put a chest underneath it so that people know what's inside of it so let's go ahead and put a tomato some lettuce and then we'll put another chest back here for a bunch of corn oh my goodness i love corn i know right corn is sick because it makes popcorn and uh, what's your favorite flavor of popcorn um i like super salty buttery popcorn like the movie theater ones hey yo bro i never go to the movie because i heard that place also makes you fat bro okay maybe i'm a little fat but stop making fun of me man all right fine i'll be nice to you from now on let's go ahead and grab some fans in here because i think every single fruit stand has a bunch of fans to keep the flies away right yeah duh all right well this is pretty much complete you could come in here and eat some food now no way and while you're doing that you could check out the awesome vault i built all right cool let me go ahead and put a little bit of carpet right here and boom look how sick it is and let me go ahead and see this vault and hey yo this is sick and yo wait what's the password don't tell the princesses though but it's zero 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 it's super secure oh man that's the most secure password ever i think i'm gonna make that my bank account password and hey yo what is this press if you're super cool subscriber wait a second i'm subscribed so what happens if i press this button uh let's go ahead and see hey, hey yo i just got five diamonds that's right if you guys subscribe on this video right now you'll get five diamonds every time you subscribe so you should spam the button all right well now that i have more diamonds we just only have some gold so we should probably put some diamond blocks in here too casey yeah we probably should i only had some gold in my inventory i thought you had all the diamonds i don't know but i guess all of our subscribers have the diamonds now oh my gosh dude that's so true every time we subscribe we literally get infinite diamonds and wait a second are you making my king throne of course i am man because you're so awesome and you're such a cool king oh my gosh i know right all right stop glazing me bro all right and i think the next base i'm gonna make casey is i think we should go ahead and make a movie theater no way that's gonna look so cool and i think while you're doing that and this looks kind of small wally we don't need that much i mean i guess we can make it bigger but we don't need to spend all our time watching movies we need to be training oh that's true actually while you're doing that i'm gonna make a little ladder in this pathway so we can set up some really cool defenses oh my gosh all right well while you do that i'm gonna put a glass roof on this thing because apparently we like glass roofs yeah glass roofs are cool because you can literally see from outside Side, which means that we will see them coming from a mile away. Oh my gosh, that's actually such a good idea, Casey. I, you know what? 
I think we should work together more often on some build challenges. Really? You think so? Uh, obviously, I think so. But first, I need to go ahead and get some couches. What color should our cushions be? Gray? I think gray looks pretty cool. I think gray would look pretty cool since our whole base is made of gray. Wait a second. You're so true, bro. Okay, listen. Let's go ahead and put some rows of seats right here. Put one right here as well. And we can't put one there because the entrance is there. I think this is pretty good. Let's go ahead and make this wall out of some black wool. So we have a massive screen. And then I don't know how to build a projector, but I think you do, right, Casey? Of course I know how to build a projector. It's super easy. All right, well, while you do that, I'm also going to put some tables in the front of the movie theater where you can grab popcorn. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. All right, I'm coming over and I'm going to build a super cool projector. Oh my gosh, wait a second. Let me go ahead and watch you build this projector. It better be sick. Oh, it's going to be cool. I promise. Okay. All right, well, while you do that, I'm going to see what the view looks like. And hey, yo, this movie theater looks sick. We should probably put some posters in here as well. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. But anyways, what we do to build this projector is we put down some chains and then we're going to put these two slabs across, which has all the components. And then we put a little boom. And now we have this awesome projector. Oh my gosh, this does look pretty sick. All right, well, the movie theater is now complete. What other room should we make, Casey? What about the gaming room? We need a gaming room in case we're not doing any king activities. Exactly. And I need a place to blow off some steam, okay? Yeah, but I'll beat you in most arcade games because I'm just so cool and good at them. Oh yeah, you want to bet? Come inside of the new gaming room, Casey. Boom! Look at this place. It looks sick. Oh my gosh, it does look cool. But I think if we put some disco lights on the top, it'll look really cool and really colorful in here. Wait a second, that would look pretty sick. But I think that we should also put some purple carpet right here as well. And then we could go ahead and grab the arcade machines. Uh, which arcade machines do you want in this place? Um, I really like the Roxy Raceway one and the Sonic one. Okay, there we go. We got that. And then also, I think we need to put a TV in here as well. Oh my gosh, can we have a Nintendo Switch as well? Because I want to be a gamer. Of course, we can have two TVs so we can each play a Switch. So let me go ahead and grab a gray Switch as well as a pink one. Boom. We'll put it on the counters just like that. And boom. Now we have a place to play our switches. Yeah, but we literally can't sit anywhere. So I'm going to put some sofas down real quick so we can sit down and enjoy our gaming. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty sick. And then we also need some more posters in here. Let me go ahead and grab three of these posters. Let's go ahead and put a Sonic one on the wall. That looks pretty sick. A FNAF one looks pretty sick too. How's that look? Oh my gosh, dude. I love Five Nights at Freddy's. Uh, I do too. All right. What else do we need to put into our awesome kingdom to make it better than the princesses one? Okay. Well, we literally don't even have a bedroom for the king. So like, uh, how are we going to sleep? Um, well, maybe we should go ahead and make a hidden entrance under my throne to the bedroom. Oh my gosh, that's such a good idea. So let's real quick grab some ghost blocks and then let's make it so you just fall straight through. All right, well, while you do that, I'm going to go ahead and go on a scouting mission to the girl's side. Oh my gosh, stay safe and don't die and get caught. All right, I will. And uh, yo, wait a second. I just realized these worms are tall. Whatever, it doesn't matter because we are strong and powerful. And I also think we should make some defenses whenever I get back. And wait a second, Casey. Yeah, what's up? Their base looks sick. Okay, wait a second. They're putting in an outside wall. They have a bunch of towers, but there's literally nothing inside of their base yet. No rooms, no nothing. Oh my goodness. Are you saying our base is cooler? Um, I do think it's cooler, but I mean, theirs looks more aesthetically pleasing though. We need to go ahead and make what we did on the front and put it on all sides. All right, Casey, I'm back from our expedition. And what did you do down here? How do I get down there? Um, I'm trying to make it like a super cool room, but there's so much sand down here. Oh my gosh. All right. Well, while you're doing that, I think I'm going to go ahead and build some defenses and shoot something at their base. Oh my gosh. Are you? Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and put a bunch of fire dispensers at them. So let me go ahead and grab a dispenser just like this and go ahead and put three of them right here. Now, all I need to do is grab some redstone and make a slight little contraption and it should work. So let me go ahead and grab some fire charges. Uh, is it fire charges or fireballs, Casey? It's fire charges. Oh my gosh. All right. Well, let's go ahead and fill this thing up. Let's go ahead and do the same with this one as well as this one. And I'm going to go ahead and see if it's working. Let's go ahead and three, two, one and boom. Did it work? Oh, you didn't even build it right. You got to place them on top. Oh my gosh, I'm such a noob. Let's go ahead and do it. And hey, yo, is that going to reach their base? Oh my gosh. Oh man, wait a second. It reached the raft. Look, the raft is literally on fire. Oh my goodness. All right, I'm going to shoot a couple more. Yeah, I keep shooting them. Keep shooting them. Okay, I'm shooting. I'm shooting. I'm shooting. Is it hitting their base? It's hitting the base. It's on fire. Let's go. Hey, uh, what is this? Hey, girls, our base is burning. Wait, what do you mean? Yeah, the roof. Look at it. Get it out. Take it out. I'm trying my best. Oh my gosh, Casey, they're freaking out. Oh my gosh, dude, their whole base is on fire. All right, I'm gonna shoot a couple more. Who keeps doing this? Oh my gosh, why are the girls complaining? Here, have some more fireballs. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh, we're literally sieging their castle from so far away. Exactly, and I think I can go ahead and make this thing even better. So let's go ahead and grab a comparator. All right, let's go ahead and place this and see if it works. And did it work? Oh wait, I have to push it on in. Boom! Wait, how does this thing work, Casey? Bro, you literally have no clue what you're doing. Why are you using a comparator? I thought that thing went pop, pop, pop. It doesn't do. Come on, how do I use this thing? All right, whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm just gonna go ahead and spam this thing with my finger as many times as I can. Hey, uh, where are these coming from? The trees are on fire too now. Wait, what do you mean the trees are on fire? Oh my gosh, wait, Casey, this is sick. Oh my gosh, I literally made such an automatic machine. Yo, this is so sick. All right, well, I think I'm gonna lay off on the firepower because it kind of looks like we did a lot of damage. Yeah, besides, we have to build your bedroom. Come follow me. All right, I'm gonna come follow you. All right, and if we looked right down here and we right click this, it turns into a secret trap door to your super secret bedroom. Oh man, wait a second. This is actually sick. And yo, this bedroom is massive. All right, well, first things first, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a bed. So let's go ahead and grab some black beds as well as, uh, I don't know, uh, what color bed should I grab? A gray one as well, maybe? Go ahead and put it in the middle. And I think I need two of them. Boom, this looks sick. That does look super cool. And I think we could add these really cool rims to it. But I think you need to get it from the side. So let's put it through the front like that. And I think we could do something really cool using some string right here like this. I know it looks kind of weird, but then we could put the carpet on top like that. And we have this really cool like little overhang. Oh, this is sick. And actually, I think what we're also gonna need is some bedside table. So let's go ahead and put some right here. Boom. And now I can go ahead and place a fan as well as a couple of my awesome objects on there. Like, I don't know, a plant. So let me grab a pot. Oh, where, where are the pots? And then, oh, what else should I get? A cactus, because cactuses are cool. What's your favorite plant, Casey? Uh, my favorite plant is a dead bush, because it's so cool and prickly and dead. Hey, yo, wait a second. You're weird, bro. Everyone comment down below how weird Casey is. I'm not that weird, man. You're calling me fat and weird. Why are you making fun of me? All right, well, this is looking pretty good, but I always like to have a little bit of carpet in my room. So let me go ahead and grab some of this dark gray carpet and see if it looks any better. Hey, yo, I just broke the wall. Oh my gosh, I'm so lazy. And this is looking pretty good. What do you think, Casey? I think it looks really cool, but I think we need a really cool painting in here. And oh my gosh, look at these two guys fighting. And look at this one. This is Sir Piggington. Look, it looks like Paige. Hey, yo, wait a second, bro. You can't be mean to her. She's not even here right now. Yeah, whatever. All right, well, let's go ahead and put another painting right there. As well as we have an awesome gaming room, an awesome movie theater, a war room to strategize, and we have an armory. What else should we put in our awesome base, Casey? I don't know, but it looks like we have one more space right here to put a really cool build. Well, I know what we're gonna put over in this area because honestly, I really need it as your knight and I need an archery range so I can have really good aim. Oh yeah, true. We do need an archery room. So while you go ahead and work on that, I'm gonna go ahead and make the walls. All right, that sounds good. And these walls are gonna be pretty simple. All I need to do is slash slash walls once again. Boom. Now we have a place to put another door in. Ayo, I just made the door way too big. Let me go ahead and steal the garage door from over here and place it down right here. And now we have an awesome place to put an archery range. Oh my God. Gosh, this is gonna be so cool. And if we put that right there and then we put some carpet down, we're able to have a really good spot where I can aim my bow and shoot it. Oh yeah, this is gonna be super sick. We should probably put a one all the way up here so that we can train for aerial attacks. Oh my gosh, look, I almost hit a bullseye. Wait a second, give me one. I wanna try, actually, let me go ahead and get my own bow and arrow. Let's go ahead and grab that as well as an arrow. Uh, what type of arrows did you use, just normal ones? I just use normal arrows. All right, well, let me go ahead and see if I can get a bullseye and boom, and Ayo, I missed the bullseye. Well, now that everything is complete, we can go ahead and shoot this. And now that there's a breadstone signal that pops out so we can know if we hit the target. And watch this. I'm going to go ahead and spam this thing like a blaster. Oh my goodness, bro. You're so good at shooting the bow. I need to get so much better. I think that's why you're king. Exactly. Well, it looks like our base is pretty much complete. And Ayo, wait a second. Dude, did you not see that? They can clearly tell there's probably a vault right here. Yeah, you're probably right. Well, there's nothing that a little magic can't fix. Oh, uh, what if we put a dance floor on top of our vault? Oh my gosh, that's such a good idea. I'll go ahead and grab the speakers while you do that. And let me go ahead and put them all over the wall. So let's put one up here, one right here, and one right here. And now we have so much tunes to put in here as well as, uh, what is that thing called? A disco ball? Yeah, I think it's called a disco ball. Hold up, let me go ahead and help you with this floor real quick. And yo, this is gonna be so sick. Uh, what type of dances are you gonna do? I, I think we should go ahead and hit the gritty. 
You're gonna hit the gritty. I'm gonna hit the floss because I'm just so cool. Oh my gosh. Floss is so 2018. Come on. No, I don't know what you're talking about, bro. All right. Well, let me go ahead and put the disco ball right here. And boom. Now we have a place to dance. This is gonna be so sick. And wait a second. We should probably go ahead and make this a little bit darker because, you know, every dance floor is a little bit dark. Yeah, that's actually a really good idea. All right. So let me do that and do slash slash set black. And boom. Now we have black wool in here. And this place is looking bumping. Hey, yo. Now we can dance. But now that that's finished. I think our base is complete, Casey. Let's go ahead and see if the girl's base is any better than ours. I don't think it is, though, because our base is so cool. I know, right? All right, well, let's go ahead and see. All right, girls, are you guys ready? Because we finished our awesome castle and uh, your uh, not-so-awesome castle. Which one should we tour first? Well, let's go to ours first. All right, well, let's go ahead and do that. Lead the way. Show us the tour. Of course. If you come over here, you can see our awesome gate in front. Wow, this is so cool. Okay, they're front is might be a little better than ours, Wally. Yeah, they, they actually have flags that we kind of forgot to give our nation a flag. Oops. Your nation doesn't have a flag? Imagine! That's like the main thing you guys need. How are you guys gonna tell it's even yours? Um, I don't know, but why do you guys have a bunch of wood and hay and stuff? Um, because obviously we need supplies. Alright, well I guess that's true. Alright, well let's go into your base. Let's see how cool and awesome it is. Oh, it's very cool and awesome. So, if you come over here, we have our beautiful beautiful purple kitchen. Okay, okay. This is like an average kitchen. I give it like a 2 out of 10. Hey, what do you mean average? What? It's it's not that crazy. We have everything we need. What's in the fridge? Empty fridge. Come on, guys. You need to stock up full of food. We just moved in, Wally. All right, fine. I guess you're not going to go grocery shopping yet. And yo, y'all got a big old TV. Yup. And we have so many sofas. We can have so many guests over. This is sick. And wait a second. Guys, why do you have a tree growing in your house? Uh, because it's awesome. And we can decorate it whenever we like. It's kind of weird, though. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, well, come here. We have a gaming area right here. Oh, my gosh. You guys have Sonic 2? Yo, this is sick. And what is this, guys? Is this modern art? It's not my choice of art. Hey, what do you mean? What is that supposed to mean, Jessica? <laughs> oh, nothing. Don't worry about it. You know, we should check out our rooms instead. All right, let's go ahead and check out your bedrooms. And hey, yo, wait, who's got the gaming setups? Not me. I don't play games. One of them is mine. This is a pretty cool bedroom, but, and also I saw that you guys have your suits over here. Um, I guess this is pretty cool, but I think our base is way better, right, Casey? Yeah, this one just feels a little empty, honestly. Fine, then show us our room. Come over here to our awesome castle. Let's see your awesome castle that you say of. All right, well, this is our awesome castle. Everyone come this way to our awesome bridge and you'll be able to come inside. Ow! Hey, wait, Rebecca? Hey! Yo, they just died! Casey, let's go! Well, I guess that means our base is a little bit more defended than theirs because they can't even get past this stupid bridge! I know, right? All right, fine. We'll fix the bridge so you guys can come over. All right, we fixed the bridge. Come on through into our awesome castle! And oh, I almost fell for our own trap! <laughs> awesome! Hey! Wait, what just happened to them? Did they all slip through it? Jessica, get in there! What? No! Wally? All right, fine. Sorry, I'll fix it. Uh, did you guys fall into the void by chance? Yes. Dude, we wanted to booby trap our base. All right, well, welcome into our awesome castle. This is our awesome place. We have a fruit market right here full of a bunch of food and produce and stuff. It's pretty sick. Oh, I love oranges. Who's selling? Well, I'm the one selling because I'm always the one doing all the work because he's the king and I do everything around here because I love my king so much. Actually, I made this, okay? I made this. All right, everyone come over this way. This is our war room. War room? Wait a minute. Is that our base? Wait, that is. We have to keep track of all the islands in the area and you're one of them. Sorry, buddy. Uh, are you trying to go to war with us? Um, not yet. Uh, you haven't made me mad yet. What do you mean not yet, Wally? You haven't made me mad. Anyways, let's change the topic and let's look at another room. Uh, let's go over to our our awesome armory where we give all of our troops armor and also a place for them to eat and sleep. You know what? Fine. This looks kind of cool. Right, right. And if you look in here, they have a bunch of weapons. Lightning swords. Whoa, this is so cool. Purple like me. Brooke, t get rid of the sword. It's very dangerous. Are you sure, Wally? How would you know? All right, whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm in creative mode. Give me back the sword. Hey! Okay, guys, this way. Oh, hey. Ah! Ow, that hurt me. Chill, chill. I told you it's powerful. Oh, that's what it does. All right, everyone. This is our movie theater. We have a bunch of popcorn and seats. Ooh, 
Ooh, can I drop by here to watch some movies? Um, only if we, you uh, lose against the war with us, sure. What? Wait, what do you mean the war? If you come this way, we have another gaming room with some TVs and some Nintendo Switches. Oh, awesome. You even got a Sonic poster? Wait, do you guys have four of the same Sonic arcade games? We just like that game a lot, okay? Well, yeah, in case one of us is playing, there's always three more available for other people to play. Exactly, and then if you come over here, we have our arch range where we practice shooting bows and arrows. Oh, wow. It's kind of small. Yeah, and I'm super good at aiming. Oh, wait, bro, bro, you missed. Ow! Hey! Yeah. Oh, I know. I think I'm hitting the right target. All right. All right. And then if you come over here, this is my awesome throne. But I mean, you just have to look at that. And then we have an awesome dance room. Oh, you have a dance room? This is nice. Wait, where's the music? Um, I turn it off for right now because we're giving the tour. But normally there's a bunch of cool music like Coco Melon playing. And then if we come over here, we have my awesome bedroom. Whoa, it's underneath your chair? Oh, of course it is. This is so cool. Uh, this is kind of small. What do you mean it's kind of small? I have a king-sized bed. Because I'm a king. Uh, this is king-size? I mean, yeah, but there's, like, nothing in here. Yeah. Casey, why do they not like my bedroom? I'm not really sure. I think it looks really cool. No, you just must have bought it off of uh, Amazon like I did. Amazon? I did not buy it off of Amazon. Mine was an authentic $500 million one. Uh, sounds like you wasted a lot of money. Ah, uh, that's what I'm saying. Excuse me? All right, well, at least we know that our nation is richer than theirs, right, Casey? Yeah, Ours is definitely a lot more rich. Yeah, but then ours is prettier. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I guess we should let everyone watching the video decide. And they're obviously gonna pick ours. I mean, come on. Ours looks so pretty and cute and pink. Ew, no, it's not. All right, well, let's go ahead and ask them. Everyone watching this video, comment down below. Whose face was better, the princesses or the kings? Obviously us. And if you see the video on screen, click subscribe and also click it because it's an awesome video. Okay, bye-bye.